Welcome guys to part 12 in Fallout 4 Let's Play series. Uh, yeah, so Diamond City is close by. I'm just gonna run to it. And just get the right way there. Okay. Hey guy, Trinity Tower, signal found. I need to listen to this to get the help on Mayday or whatever it is one says on a radio. My name is Rex Goodman. I'm being held prisoner on the top of Trinity Tower. I think the super mutants plan on eating me soon. I'm setting this to repeat. Ah oh, shit, gotta sign off. One of the super mutants is coming. Help or. Mayday or whatever it is one says on a radio. My name is Rex Goodman. Okay, it's Rex Goodman and he's held hostage on top of a uh, Trinity Tower. So I'll go and save him later. Okay, there's an arrow that way, so I'm gonna go that way. I'm not gonna draw my gun this time because in the previous part I have in fact shot a uh, a uh, security officer by mistake protected by the wall yeah don't shoot I'm in city is it in here? Ooh. Too steep to climb. Refreshments. Not in here. Yes, they did a lot of effort with it. Oh, can switch off this terminal probably. And all the power will go off. But yeah, not now. But later. All of this will attack me. Diamond City. This way. What do you mean you can't open the gate? Stop playing around, Danny. I'm standing out in the open here for crying out loud. I got orders not to let you in, Miss Piper. I'm sorry. I'm just doing my job. Hi. Ooh, just doing your job. Protecting Diamond City means keeping me out, is that it? <laughs> oh, look, it's the scary reporter. <clears throat> I'm sorry, but Mayor McDonough's really steamed, Piper. Saying that article you wrote was all lies. The whole city's in a tizzy. Hey, the damsel you in distress. Right now, Danny Sullivan. I live here. You can't just lock me out. <sighs> Open this gate right now. You. You want into Diamond City, right? Yeah. I just got here, but yeah. Shh. What, what's that? You said you're a trader up from Quincy? You have enough supplies to keep the general store stocked for a whole month? <laughs> you hear that, Danny? You gonna open the gate and let us in? Or are you gonna be the one talking to crazy Myrna about losing out on all the supply? Jeez, all right. I need to make it personal, Piper. Give me a minute. That's easy. Better head inside quick before old Danny catches on to the bluff. Sounds good. Let's go. Another great day in Diamond City. Let me stick with her. Piper, who let you back inside? I told Sullivan to keep that gate shut. You devious, rabble-rousing slanderer. The level of dishonesty in that paper of yours. I'll have that printer scrapped for parts. Ooh, that a statement, Mr. McDonough? Tyrant mayor shuts down the press. Why don't we ask the newcomer? You support the news? Because the mayor's threatened to throw free speech in the dumpster. 
What newspaper are you talking about? Mine. Public occurrences. And we're the hard look at the truth. So are you with us or not? Um... This really isn't any no, of my business. Stay out of this one. Oh, I didn't mean to bring you into this argument, good sir. No, no, no. You look like Diamond City material. Welcome to the great green jewel of the Commonwealth. Safe, happy, a fine place to come. Spend your money, settle down. Don't let this yeah, muckraker here tell you otherwise, all right? I'm sure your city's a great place. <laughs> yeah, greatest house of cards in the Commonwealth. Until the wind blows. <laughs> now, was there anything particular you came to our city for? Yeah, I'm missing trying person. to find someone. Trying to find someone? Who? Who would I talk to about finding a missing person? Well, whatever you do, don't bother going to Diamond City Security for help. Uh, don't listen to her. Well, I'm afraid that our security team can't follow every case that comes through. I'm confident that you can find help here. Diamond City has every conceivable service known to man. One of our great citizens can surely find the time to help you. Okay. I hope so. <sighs> this is ridiculous. I want the truth, McDonough. What's the real reason security always shrivels away when talk of missing persons? I've had enough up? of this, Piper. From now on, consider you and that little sister of yours on notice. Yeah, keep talking, McDonough. That's all you're good for. Right. Mmm, a big Diamond City welcome from the mayor. You feel honored yet? Look, I gotta go get settled in, but, um, stop by my office later. I have an idea for an article you'd be perfect for. Okay. I give you give. Head on inside. Okay. Hey, so you're that traitor Piper was talking about. Something tells me she's pulled the wool over my eyes again. Am I right? Uh, I didn't mean to lie, officer. It all just happened so fast. Oh, sure it did. Happened so fast you forgot all about basic human decency. Didn't your mother ever teach you to be honest? Hey, what's brought you into town anyway? Be good to note it down That's in the fail. logs. I'm trying to find someone. Is that so? Who are you looking for? An infant boy. Kidnapped. Oh, look, I'm sorry, but we're under orders not to get involved in missing person cases. There's a lot of institute paranoia right now. We can't really risk fanning those flames with official action. What if people panic? Right. How about we do a simple trade? Money for information. Hey, I don't take bribes, okay? No. Okay. The Institute? What's that? Ah, oh, damn. Look, I really shouldn't have said that. They're just a scapegoat, all right? Something people blame when things go wrong. If you really want to know, there's a whole newspaper inside the city that won't stop talking about them. Public occurrences. Okay. I'll ask somewhere else then. Chin up. Maybe someone in town can help you? Maybe. What's up? Let's go find that. Okay. Don't stop walls. Dr. Brainwash. Every issue of the Soviet will collect as a rank in the unstoppable perk, which grants a slight increase in the chance. So, this is the famous Diamond City. I suppose I hope to find more of a gem than a dusty home base. Civilization in the rough, if you will. <laughs> I love God's word. God. Yes. So, goody, goody. Okay. Wow. That looks nice. Uh, you've been saying that for weeks and the little girl still keeps cranking. Stop worrying so much. I gotta head into the office. You start whistling if you see any angry politicians coming our way. Why? Is something wrong? Piper? 
<gasps> Free paper to newcomers. If the Institute grabs you in the night, at least we warned you. Thanks, I guess. I'm serious. The Institute takes people. You should read up if you're sticking around. I believe you. Thanks. You are a real lost lamb in the wolf's den, mister. So what are you doing in Diamond City anyway? I came here looking for someone. Let me guess. That someone's gone missing, right? That's what I'm telling you. So who is it? I'm looking for Sean. He's my son. Less than a year old. You have a son, mister? Man, you're old. You're in bad luck. No one tries to find missing people in Diamond City. Missing people means the Institute is involved. And no one's going to want to get the Institute's attention. You're a smart kid. Isn't there someone in town who isn't afraid of this Institute? Well, there is the detective, Mr. Nick Valentine. He's not afraid of anything. If anyone's going to help you, it's him. Okay, let's Thanks. see Nick Valentine. You were a big help. Remember, the Institute's out there, newcomer. Watch your back. Read the public and be prepared. Okay. I gotta level up. Okay, so let's take uh, let's take charisma for this mission. I'm gonna need it. Anyone is one of those things. It's that secretary of his, her and her perfect hair. Do yourself a favor. Uh -huh. Just say yes. It's all he understands. Yes. Yeah. Look up. Okay. You wouldn't be able to tell the difference. You Nick McDonough with your razor, he bleed. Don't mean nothing. Hmm. Um, Who needs a haircut? Uh, Everyone needs a haircut. Step up. I don't even want President. Oh, is that a protection? Hey, man. Got a lot of chems here if you need something to help you relax. <laughs> Drugs? Let's see what yeah. you have. Self serve medicine. <laughs> I need. I to go blood packs for him. Med X damage resist. Park. Rad X right away. Whoa, that's expensive. I tell you what, let me give you stuff. At least now I can buy it. It's Cigarettes. Flare, flare, gun, flare, Use mines. Hot flower. Iguana bites. Iguana on the feet. Some jet. All right, chunks. Date the curse. Snap camera. Uh, roach meat. Cool. Scissors. Pattern. Hunting rifle. Shotgun shells. Okay. 
steel. I have a shitload, so I'm gonna give you some. Okay, some machine gun. Sugar bombs. Okay, making orders I can give because uh, Tarberry, Pipeline, Turpentine, well, Wedding Ring. I have two Wedding Rings. I'm gonna sell one. It's no use to me. Okay. So, let's buy that. Okay, except okay. Now at least I can get freaking rid of this pesky right away. There we go. Ah, oh, that's much better. Oh man, you got a robot butler? No, I need Solomon back. You look like you need a prescription pill. Something to settle your nerves. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Chill. Let's see what you got. Got your fix. Okay, stem packs. Where's stem packs? Stem steel. Scissors. There we go. Oh. Okay. You. I'm cities. Perfection for sale. You? I, I don't know you. Just keep your distance. Swanus, right here. New guy, am I right? Yes. Yeah, I'm the new guy. Well, it's good to have you here. Name's Arturo Rodriguez. If you need protection, let's talk. Let's see what you have. Don't forget to stock up on ammo. Okay, big boy. Whoa. Mini nuke. <laughs> that looks freaking awesome. Yeah. <laughs> so thirsty. Sheffield. Doctor says I can't drink liquor no more. Cola. Need a new Coca Cola. You then. You need a genuine potion. Give Sheffield a new Coca Cola. Okay, I need a new Coca Cola to give him. Hey, Sheffield. Need a drink. New Coca Cola. Okay. What's with you vault dwellers in those jumpsuits, huh? Newcomer, huh? Talk to Abbott in the wall if you want a history lesson. Is that thing shaking? Yes. Yes. No, I need new Coca-Cola. Okay, I need to find Victor's schoolhouse. Detective. Okay, that's random. Today. Okay, wait. Let me first. Okay, I have Diamond City Market. Place Road to Freedom, follow the Freedom Trail. Go to Piper's office, investigate the radio broadcast. Oh, 
Oops, sorry. His ties. Something wrong? Another stray coming in from the rain. Rage you're too late. Office is closed. I know you must be busy, but I won't take much of your time, miss. It's important. You don't get it. The detective, he's gone. Missing. Do you have any idea how I could find him? He disappeared working a case. Skinny Malone's gang had kidnapped a young woman, and he tracked them down to their hideout in Park Street Station. There's an old vault down there they use as a base. I told Nick he was walking into a trap, but... He just smiled and walked out the door like he always does. Okay. Who's this Skinny Malone character? I don't know much about him, but he's from Good Neighbor, and that means he's in the well-pressed suits and machine gun school of thuggery. Okay. I'll find him. You have my word. Thank you. Nick should be easy to spot. He's always wearing that old hat and trench coat getup. Please, hurry. Okay, so I needed to have to find the private, uh, my son was the private detective. Now, I need to find the private detective. Awesome. Let's get to it. Find Nick Valentine. Yeah, let's get that up. Uh, unlike Valentine, find Nick Valentine. Maps. There is no Valentine. So if there. Well, guys, join me to find Valentine in part 13. See you 